everybody and welcome back to my channel. Um, in the new year I decided I wanted to do some different kinds of videos so for you today I'm going to be filming a uh, scrapbooking haul. I did a stationery haul in September that seemed to go over well and this is a lot more fun. This is stuff for scrapbooking so it's pretty and um, kind of expensive. I went to Michael's and I actually went to a dollar store that's nearby me as well just because it has a really great craft section but it's a lot less expensive. So let's just kind of jump in. Um, I'm going to save the best thing till last, but for now, um, I will start with stuff that I got at Michael's. So the first thing I got is actually kind of boring, and it's a box. They had all of their Valentine's Day themed boxes on sale for $2.50, and I just need one to hold all of like my stickers and embellishments and stuff, so I just grabbed one of these because it was inexpensive, but it's also super cute with all these red dots on it. And actually, I'm already one step ahead because I put all of my stickers and embellishments that I bought in it. Um, on top here, I've got two things from the dollar store. Um, they're both by a brand called Forever in Time, and they have really, really nice stuff that's super inexpensive. Um, I bought these hand handmade tags. They're 3D, and they're for, like, traveling and adventures and stuff like that so I thought these were cute and they were only $1.50 so there's a couple in here I probably won't use but otherwise I think they're awesome and then I also bought these black and gold um, raised foiled letters these are awesome and I have a specific purpose for these ones um, I'm gonna use them for an event that I went to so I'm super super excited to use these as well and they're just they're gorgeous they remind me a little bit of like the Great Gatsby then I grabbed some embellishments from Michaels, and usually these are really expensive, but I managed to get each one of these for only $1.50 a piece, which I was super, super happy about. Um, so I got some of these purple crystal dots. Um, I go to Laurier, and our colors are purple and gold, so purple dots are perfect, and these are like little crystals. They're just, they're super cute, super sparkly. Perfect. I also got um, some white silver ones. These are really nice too, and they have a little adhesive backs. Both of these have little adhesive backs, so they're easier to just stick onto your projects without the mess of glue. And then I actually got two packs of letters, and these are gold sparkly letters. I'm going to use these with these letters here, so like capitals and, um, or first letter and then subsequent letters, basically. Um, I, yeah, I don't really have much else to say about these. They're sticky, again, no mess of glue. I hate using glue when I scrapbook. It just gets everywhere and it's super messy and gross. So, yeah, I got two packs of those so that I have enough for spelling multiple words because I hate it when you get a pack of these and there aren't enough letters in it. It drives me nuts. Like, how am I supposed to complete a project if I've only got two A's? Anyway, awesome. I also bought some paper. This is also from the dollar store, which I think is amazing because these sheets are kind of expensive. Some of them were like two or three dollars when I was at Michael's the other day. They're all different colors with gold on them. So I've got a white with gold stripes. I've got a black with gold dots. And then I've got just kind of um, a brown regular paper with large gold dots on it. And I already know what I want to use these for, so I'm super excited to use the pages. And then for the most exciting part of this haul, Michaels had a big sale on, and they had um, scrapbooks, buy one, get one free. I love it when they do deals like that. They are expensive, but if you can find one of those deals, they you can get some really, really good discounts. So their 10-page scrapbooks were uh, $17 a piece, but with the buy one, got one free, you got two for $17. And I have page extenders um, from a previous project, so 10 pages isn't too few for me. So I got this beautiful white and teal one. Um, these Their scrapbooks are so nice and so well made. Oh, I have something else in here that I bought. So I got one of these white and teal ones. Their scrapbooks are just so nice, so well made, and I'm really excited to start putting projects in these. And then the other scrapbook that I got is this one, and it's white, um, brown, pink, and kind of a minty color. Um, and this is actually gold here. I don't know if you can see that or not. So it's just really pretty. It's something different. And again, it's just 10 pages, but... I'm really, really excited to use this. This is what it looks like on the inside. 
So I'm really, really excited to start doing these. I was sorting out my closet and I found a box of scrapbooking stuff that I hadn't done anything with. So thus I needed to buy some new stuff and get going. Alright, so that's it for this little scrapbooking haul. If you would like to see something um, with scrapbooking pages or like completed projects, please let me know. I have completed quite a few over the years. It's one of my favorite hobbies. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll leave a link to my blog down below and I will see you next week with another video. Bye!